Hey y'all, this here is Trucker Steve from Florida, currently in North Carolina. You're watching Trucker Josh Vlogs. Good morning everybody, we're at our first delivery of the day, delivering these crates. Just finished unloading. So all the rest of these are going to Prince Albert, Saskatchewan. Wait one second here, why is this so crooked? Why is that crooked like that? That's gonna... I better fix that. Okay, well, fix that before we go. All the rest of these 13 of these crates, no idea what's in them. No idea at all, just 13 mysterious mystery crates all going to the same place. So once this is empty, we head over to Meadow Lake, Saskatchewan. I'm gonna load up some lumber and head home. I don't think I'll make it home tonight. I'll be home tomorrow though. And then we'll head out again from home on Monday towards Wisconsin with it. So I told my last customer here I'm gonna be there at about 10 o'clock and it's 9.30 right now and we have 150 or so kilometers to go, so. Gave him a heads up saying, hey, running a little later than I thought I would. They said, that's awesome, cool, see you when you get here. I love happy people. So, uh, we've never taken the route we're gonna take. We're gonna go up uh, Highway 20, right from Humboldt here, straight north, and see what happens. Looks like a pretty small, narrow road, but it was a pretty small, narrow road getting up here. I mean, it is Saskatchewan. Turn right on <laughs> So Mandy wants to take me 221 kilometers around and Google wants me to go 142 kilometers through the shortcut and I checked the shortcut myself and it looks legit. So we're going for it. We're just going to send it. See what happens. Turn right on 8th Street, Main Street. Exciting. Oh boy, I got two women yelling at me again. Stop fighting over me, ladies. I'm already married. So we got uh, downtown to go through here yet. I'm hoping we'll be able to find somewhere to grab a coffee. I haven't had a coffee yet. I'm thinking maybe I should run over to Timmy's to grab a coffee yet. I don't really want Timmy's coffee. Just a gas station coffee would be all right. There's a gas station off on the left here. I bet you they sell coffee. I bet you they do. But there's nowhere to park. My truck's too long to park anywhere here. We'll find something. It's gonna be a good day. But we're driving straight into the storm, so it's gonna be a kind of a, a wet good day. changed my mind. We're gonna run to the other end of town and grab a coffee real quick. And it's driving Mandy nuts. She's just been yelling at me nonstop. Google's been all right with it. She's been like, okay, you wanna go this way? Cool, we'll just go this way then. Mandy, she's all up in arms. 
gonna start yelling at me again here right away. Think she knows better than me. I'm the boss, Mandy. What's she telling me to do? Okay, now she agrees that we should go this way. It's gonna really confuse her when I go back that way. Just want a coffee. Continue 43 kilometers on five. No, Tim Hortons is right here. I don't need to go 43 kilometers. She's gonna be so mad. Does not want me to turn. Both of them are gonna be yelling at me for this. Let's see what happens. I'm gonna be going right past where we slept last night. <coughs> Oh, of course, there's a guy with a boat parked right in the middle of the parking area so that I won't be able to fit in there. That's okay. We'll make it work. Just pull in behind him. Right here behind this boat, this is where uh, I slept last night. I'm surprised my GPS isn't yelling at me. I don't think she knows where we are. <laughs> Back home for a bit. Tim Hortons is... Uh, well, where is Tim Hortons from here? I might want to go a little further down this road. Bit of a walk from here. You know what? Yeah, we're going to go a little further. Go back. Nice boat here, though, eh? Sort of makes me want to do some fishing. Where is Tim Hortons? There's Boston Pizza. Went in there yesterday, last night. Humboldt Vision Center. That's definitely not Tim Hortons. Well, there it is. It's a weird looking Tim Hortons. The one on the left there, I've never seen a Tim Hortons like that, designed like that. I guess Humboldt is one of those towns that gotta be different, you know? <laughs> That's okay. We love Humboldt. Okay, so it's just off here to our left. So I'm going to uh, figure this out. Dodge over here is very confused. I don't blame him. I don't know what I'm doing either. I just want a coffee. Man, I haven't had my coffee yet. Leave me alone. I'm gonna park right over here like this. We'll make it work. Just like that, you see? Fit in your dress, perfect. I want my coffee, leave me alone, people. He unloaded this whole side first, which is strange, because usually they'd unload the top first and then, you know, work their way down so that there's not too much weight on one side of the trailer, but whatever works. I mean, each one of these crates, the mystery crates, is only like 650 pounds, so. I should be on this side while he's unloading anyways. There he goes. Just a couple left. That's an interesting McDonald's over there across the street. You see that? Looks like a, a grain bin turned into a McDonald's. That's neat. So our trailer is empty. And we're making our way to Meadow Lake. Two and a half hours. Well, it should be under three, but I want to stop and grab a snack yet, another coffee before we get there. So it'll probably end up being about three hours. And we'll get there during business hours. So I don't even have to arrange a late loading appointment. Got wood? These people do. Got lots of wood here. It's amazing how much they pile up. And all of these logs are like exactly the same size. It's amazing that they can find so many trees like that are almost identical. <laughs> I don't know what this guy's doing here. I think he's stopping here to go get his paperwork. Can I park in front of him? 
Anyone in front of them? Nope, I'm gonna go park in front of them. There he's walking back from the office. I don't know why he parked so far back. Gotta go into the office here and get my paperwork. Well, it's three o'clock and apparently their shipping has gone home already, so. And I've been here before. Usually they'll leave my paperwork with the loader then, because he's here till 10. But there it says right on their door they're supposed to be open till 4 p.m. So I don't know why they get to go home early. And why they wouldn't put up a note or a notice or something. So I hope we don't run into problems back here. I mean I gotta go around the corner here and uh the loader will come and talk to me and he should have my paperwork and if he doesn't I'm gonna be a little upset because I got here within business hours posted business hours with no warning that shipping was going home early and it's a Friday which would mean I might have to wait here all weekend which would totally throw off my entire next week and I'd have to miss the family reunion let's hope that's not the case really hope that's not the case. That would really upset me. Uh, somewhere around here, gotta go around the back. There should be a line up here, hopefully not too long. Just around the corner. Oh yeah, here's the lineup already. There we go. One, two people in front of me, three people in front of me. And there's no cell service, so I can't get a hold of anybody. Let's hope everything works out. Got two of these guys loading me right now. Just giving her. They had all the paperwork they needed for me, so we're good to go. We have a uh, second guy over here just ripping it. Seriously, I think they'll be. I think these are the last ones. Why oh, he's putting these up here? Right beside me. Well, oh, pardon me, I guess it would be behind me. That guy's finishing up over there. I think they need to put another two on the step on that side yet, and that's it. We're out of here, Diesel. We have eight hours available to us to work today yet. Here comes this guy. He's gonna. Oh, okay. No, no. He's already over there. He's just putting one. What's he doing? What you doing? Ah, oh, he's doing something. These guys are awesome. They literally got me loaded in less than five minutes. And just like that, done. All set, ready to go. And now to get out of here. Wait for this guy to get out of our way. And we're off to Wisconsin with a stop at home on the way. The old Canadian wood. Going down to America. I believe my load's already been cleared for the border, so I'm set to go whenever I want to. Monday morning. Lights are on. Head out past their guard shack here. That's always vacant. No one's ever in here. These scales are for the logging trucks, not for me. Off we go. So I was wrong before. All these sticks here, they're not all the same size. They just looked the same size from a distance. They're actually a whole bunch of different sizes. They're just very neatly stacked. Very neatly stacked. Very impressive. Mind taking a truckload of those home, cutting them up. Oh, it's gonna be a nice smooth ride now. I'm probably sitting at about 78,000 pounds gross. Legal to enter the US. Way under for Canada standards. Not a chance that I'm overweight.
probably lived through another onslaught of bugs and we're in Davidson, Saskatchewan. This is where I am going to call home tonight. Oh, it looks like there's a nice parking spot right on the edge open for me too. Nice, nice, very nice. So nice. Let's see if I can get myself in here. Yeah, right on the edge there. That's where we're gonna call home. Oh boy. There's another mosquito in here. Ha! Ha! Did I get him? <laughs> gotta do it. Do it. My belt here is my pants don't fall off in front of you guys. I gotta get this. Oh, there's two mosquitoes in here. No. No, 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 no. The three. No, this keeps getting worse. Oh! One down, two to go. Where's the other one? No, no, you don't fly away from me. I'm the boss. This is my truck. You're trespassing. Oh, there's a whole bunch of them. Oh! 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 No! Ah! Oh, it's a mosquito slaughter fest in here. Oh man, are you guys getting this? Sorry, I just had to go on a mosquito killing spree. There's still another one up here. Jeez, I had my window open for like 10 seconds. And there's a bazillion mosquitoes in here. That's not cool. There's one more back here yet. Come here, come here. I got you. No, you stained my... Dang it. I have to shampoo that now. That's why I don't like killing bugs on the fabric of the truck, because it stains it. Oh. oh, I hate mosquitoes. I hate mosquitoes. There's another one! No! Ha! Ah! You're dead! What in the world? I only had my window open 10 seconds! Diesel, you gotta help me. You gotta help me, buddy. There's too many mosquitoes. There's too many mosquitoes. This is terrible. Terrible. I'm not even exaggerating. I can't sleep if there's one mosquito in here. I've killed like 10. And I stained my fabric up there. Not good. Not good. Not good. No. Oh, man. I'm gonna tell the... What? Got to tell the uh, computer here that we are all good to go. What? What in the world's going on here? Something's going on. There we go. Now my computer's not working right. Hey! I want to go to bed. <coughs> I'm going to put myself into sleeper berth here. There we go. Oh man, I'm tired. I don't even want to go outside. Diesel, can we just go outside in the morning? Can you hold it? Can you hold it, buddy? What do you say? What do you say? No? I can't hold it, there, young man. You might be out of your full. Well, buddy, here's the trade-off. You can go empty your bladder, but they're going to suck your blood. They're going to suck you dry, man. No more blood. So you either go to bed with a full bladder. Quiet, Mandy. I wasn't talking to you. Okay, we'll go outside. I'll oh, go outside. Oh, I can see them on the outside of my window. Ha! Get out of here! Ha! Stop trying to get in here. Turn the lights off in here. Oh, I hate mosquitoes. Have I mentioned that yet? Anyways, uh, thanks for watching today, everybody. Uh, tomorrow's gonna be another new day. We're gonna get home tomorrow. We have seven and a half hours uh, to go tomorrow yet. Uh, we got quite a bit done today. And it was a good day. So, uh, Hope you subscribe, hit the like button if you did like the video, or the dislike button if you didn't like the video. Leave me a comment down below, and uh, check out my social media. We're trying to boost the numbers on my like, Facebook and uh, Twitter and stuff. So if you're on Facebook and Twitter, go down below this video, the link on the YouTube page there, and uh, go follow me on those platforms too. I'd love to have you there. I'll see you a little bit later. Good night.
Better not be any more mosquitoes in here. This is Jerry from Iowa, and this is Spike. We watch TJV videos.